Brick is used as a tapestry here to weave in between the confounds of the art gallery and the public space. I think it's also really interesting for us because it shows that brick is one of those materials which in terms of its energy use is appropriate because it can be actually fully reused when it's installed in this way. It holds the ground plane and then it moves up to hold landscape and I think that's probably the key in this one is, is that brick is actually working really hard to make a landscape and this is the first pavilion at the National Gallery which is actually more about landscape than building. The other thing that we found interesting is that the bricks are actually laid without mortar so they can actually be reused somewhere else, not recycled but actually reused and that's a really interesting and conscientious thing to do environmentally. The thing we thought that was amazing about this was just that sort of temporality of the use of the brickwork, the fact that it could actually be taken away and reused, but it's sort of still had this great permanence about it. The bricks used in this project really hold the landscape. They're in many ways unexpected in this project and sit beautifully in the context of the National Gallery.